Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Scott Pilgrim vs. The World The Game Complete KO Edition. So we'll get straight into it. We'll get the plastic off guys, then we'll show you the slip cover. We'll pull the uh, box out, we'll check that out and get all the contents out as well. Get a closer look at it all. So do let us know down in the comments what you think guys. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So as you can see, it's quite a large collector's edition. So expecting to see a few different bits and pieces included here guys. So before we get to that, just show you the limited run games printed card that comes with uh, all their physical releases. And then we've got our slip cover guys, so we'll check that out. We've got the front there. Not too much detail going on the uh, slip cover here guys. And we'll slide it up. And then we've got our, it's like a briefcase I guess. Remove battery, insulating, pull tab. So there's a tab there, it tells you to remove that. We'll get to that shortly. And we'll show you the briefcase. It's got a handle here, so carry it all around. You just um, want to have a hold of that one, otherwise that'll uh, slide out. It's not very tight. Okay, so we'll pull the uh, tape off that one. And we'll pull the tab. Quite a long tab, that one, as well. And we'll see what happens once we open it up. So we... Lift up the lid, and they start playing, guys. So there you are. We'll do that again. Close it. Everything pops up. It's like a 3D pop up there. It's pretty cool. You've got the lights going on. Not too sure if they're supposed to be facing down or, um, or, or forwards there, but uh, they seem to be all facing down. This one's on a bit of a 45 degree angle there, but uh, that's that part of it, guys. We'll uh, lift it up, and again, it uh, goes back to, it turns itself off, I suppose. Uh, we have just some information regarding it. Then you bring it back down. It's got kind of a magnet, guys. So, the magnet is uh, around the middle. So, there you are. Doesn't like to stay up though. We've got this section which will hold that up then. Okay guys, so you got that uh, metal panel there that magnetizes to that and holds it up. We've got a couple of uh, drumsticks, which is quite cool. Got etching on that side as well. Both of them are etched differently. So that's very good to see. Just move these bits and pieces out of the way guys. Okay, so we've got some uh, bug poison there. Stop your contents getting eaten. Got the uh, complete edition here. Check that out shortly. Everything's wrapped up. So I'll deal with the plastic and show you all the contents. Okay. Got a uh, cassette there. I can just take this out, this tray, and see if there's anything under there. There's nothing under the tray, guys. So it's a pretty... um durable tray just get it back in the box and like so so all the contents are housed in the bottom tray there guys which is quite cool uh, we'll leave that up so it's uh, not playing while I'm trying to speak like I said we've got the uh, cassette here most guys probably don't know what a uh, cassette is but uh, before there was CDs Maybe people don't know what CDs are these days, but before there were CDs, there was cassettes so and vinyls. Uh, so we've got the front, rear, and opens up. And you've got your cassette in here, guys. Uh, so you've got side one and side two, yeah. So, so, so you'd put it in, listen to one, like one of the sides, and then you would pull it out, reverse it around, and put it in, and you'll get to, to listen to the next side. Otherwise, if it was just one-sided, you'd have to rewind it um, back in the day. So you've got side one, 12 tracks, and same with side two, guys. So pretty cool, quite a few tracks there. Just goes in the one way inside the uh, case there. Okay, moving forward, we have, uh, we'll find out, some uh, printed cards, possibly. So these are probably the villains that you come across. So you got one, two, three, four, five, and six. 
So I haven't played the game, guys, so speculating there. Do feel free to uh, let us know down in the comments, though. We've got a set of stickers here as well, which is quite nice. We have a... Uh, you can uh, get the digital guide at Primer Games if you feel like it. Got the uh, a guitar pick here. And then we have a badge. Kind of like a pixelated 8-bit badge. Next up, we've got the uh, behind the pixels. So probably an art book, guys. Should be pretty cool to check out. What we'll do, I'll show you the uh, front and rear, and then uh, in the next segment on the video, we'll flip the camera around, we get a bird's eye view, and that way you get a better viewing of the uh, art book as I flick through it, page by page. So that deals with the plastic there. We've got the front there. So hopefully we're gonna see some of the sketching on the inside, be quite impressive but uh, that's kind of what we're gonna see on the inside. So, uh, nice hard cover, and there's probably about 80 or, uh, or 100 pages in there to ch check out. So, stick around, guys. It'll be uh, pretty cool to check that one out, I think. And the last part, guys, is the complete edition game case. So, we've got the front of the slip cover and the rear. We'll lift it off. And then we've got the uh, Standard cover, so front and rear of that one, quite nice. And then in the inside, opens up, kind of like an old uh, VHS, uh, if you know what they are. All right, moving along, that is just a spacer. Just check, yep, so that's just a spacer. Um, and I'm not sure if these slide out or, uh, okay, so these little Space panel comes out, and then you can pull the contents out, guys. So it looks like we've got a soundtrack, standard game case, no steel book, which is unfortunate. Probably the only thing missing from uh, this uh, collector's edition. So check out the poster, single sided. Looks like the map. Like I said, haven't played the game, just speculating. Could be just one area, but it does. Um, have a couple of uh, signs there with um, numbers, so I'm guessing they're the areas within the map. We've got the uh, stickers, some more stickers there. We have the uh, original video game soundtrack, so I'm assuming 24 tracks, so it should be the same as the uh, cassette there, just on the CD format. Okay, so we've got the front. The rear, unfortunately, it's not a jewel case, it's just a cardboard slip cover. Uh, we've got some uh, nice detail on the front of that disc though. And the final part, guys, is the game case. Uh, complete edition, it says on the front. Just try and get rid of the plastic, then show you the front and rear, open it up. Sometimes they've got a uh, small little booklet included as well, but they'll definitely have the cartridge, which is what we want. Okay, so moving forward. We've got the front of that one, we've got the rear. Got a few bits and pieces. Still got some tape attached to the top of that one. All right, so on the inside guys, we've got some reversible cover art. Pretty cool. I do prefer the one that's there already, personally. But let us know what, uh, what you prefer. Here we've got, um, oh, it's pretty cool, uh, like a, uh, a ticket there to uh, see the band. And then here we got an instruction booklet. So, just a small little booklet, guys. It just runs through the instructions, controls, um, give you a bit of a uh, heads up what you're uh, going to be up against as you start playing the game. All right, guys, well, that's everything included in today's unboxing. So, uh, like I said earlier, do let us know down in the comments what you think. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. But for now, we're going to conclude this part of the video. Okay, guys, so we'll get straight into the art book for uh, Scott the Pilgrim. Okay. Nice image there. It looks like we've got our table of contents. Uh, it talks about the origin. Next up, we've got our concept art gallery. So you can see all the concepts here, where they all got the ideas from. Another winter. 
strategy guide. So this runs through how to play. Okay, next up we've got the walkthrough. So it talks about all the different worlds, bosses, And we've got some extra stuff up next. Bonuses. There's a shopping guide for uh, all your in-game items. So, unfortunately, not much of an art book, guys. Uh, we've got um, more information regarding the game. subspace and credits and that concludes the book guys Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave, hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Once we get to the next milestone, we do the next giveaway, so do subscribe if you're running for that, and we'll catch you next time.